Hello everyone, it's Michael. We're here at Hammerspace. I'm going to tell you, give you a little bit of a video update on the 3D printed rideable vehicle project. So down here, we've got the third version of the rear end. It incorporates a lot of changes we didn't see last time, but we're still going to go one more further past this. A few of the changes that show up in this rear end are, you'll notice the wheels are attached now, which look pretty awesome. They still need their treading. Also, we went with this new, much heavier latex tubing, which gives it a lot more strength when we push down on it. Now, ultimately, we decided to go from a two-wheel drive vehicle to a four-wheel drive vehicle, which for the final axle, which we've got over here, meant we had to make some changes. So what this one does is we actually have a drive shaft now that puts power into the rear differential, whereas with the previous version, we just had the motor attached with a chain. Now there's going to be a transfer case in the front wheels. Reels will also have power, so we have even more push on the ground. Keep, uh, keep an eye out for updates. I'm going to try to get a little bit more uh, religious on doing these videos. Thank you guys, and have fun.